Hello everybody, my name is Elizabeth and I am a volunteer for Rainbow Babies and Children's Hospital. Today I am going to read to you a holiday themed book called Reindeer Christmas. It is by Mark Kimball Moulton and it is illustrated by Karen Hillard Good. I hope you enjoy. A December snow is falling, lightly dusting all the trees, blanketing the forest in a crystal filigree. The basket that I carry holds a tasty late night treat. Yum. Carrots, corn, and apples for our forest friends to eat. We sprinkle all the goodies on the pure white snow-capped ground. Then watch the thankful animals begin to gather round. Deer and birds and bunnies come, and lots of playful mice. We've even had a regal moose indulge us once or twice. Each visit from our woodland friends makes us feel oh so blessed, but there's one special visit that stands out above the rest. What do you think it'll be? Was late one snowy evening, Christmas Day would be here soon, when in the frosted forest something shimmered like the moon. We saw the slightest movement and the flicker of an ear, and suddenly we knew that what was glowing was a deer. Have you ever seen a deer? There are lots of deer around where I live. But as we watched, he stumbled and then fell into the snow. He closed his eyes and soon began to lose his subtle glow. He looked so cold and hungry as he shivered in the storm. Grandma said, let's bring him in and make him toasty warm. We ran outside and touched the deer. He opened just one eye. And magically, he seemed to float. He almost seemed We wrapped our arms around him and we gently helped him in and brought him to the fire where he floated down again. He settled on a blanket, then Graham urged us, let him be with food and warmth and rest. He'll be as good as new, you'll see. She placed a bowl beside him filled with apples, grain, and more. He ate a bit, then closed his eyes and soon began to Snore. Much later in the evening, something woke me from my dreams. My room was softly shimmering from luminescent beams. I peered out of the window and could not believe my eyes. I thought I saw our friend the deer fly straight across the sky. I tiptoed to the fire to see if he was there. But sure enough, our deer was gone. He wasn't anywhere. The next day it was Christmas Eve and we had much to do. We found the perfect tree and then we wrapped our presents too. That night we all slept soundly as we dreamed of Christmas morn when we would wake and celebrate the day our Christ was born. The sunrise had us leaping from our beds excitedly and bounding barefoot down the stairs, shouting out with glee. Grandma served us breakfast, then she smiled in pure delight as we enjoyed each gift that Santa left for us that night. And, then, and when we thought the gifts were done, Graham reached beneath the tree and handed a small wooden box and a Christmas card to me. Hmm. Ho, 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 dear friends. For many years I've watched you with a smile upon my face, caring for our forest friends with tenderness and grace. The other day as we were placing stars among the trees, 
which help us find our way on dog trained stormy Christmas Eve. A blizzard fell upon us, and my donner lost his way. We searched for hours to no avail. All we could do was pray. Without our dear old donner's help, my sleigh would never fly. We couldn't make our yearly trip, no matter how we'd try. But thanks to you, he made it home in time to pull my sleigh. And now we are on schedule. You helped save Christmas Day. Inside this little trinket box is magic reindeer glow, which helps my reindeer fly through rain and fog and sleet and snow. Hold this box and make a wish, then close your sleepy eyes, and you will see your wish come true before the next sunrise. Santa Claus. Our forest friends still visit us each and every night, and we still watch them by the warm, soft glow of candlelight. The wooden box that Santa left was placed into my care. I've treasured it for all these years as magic so rare. I've wanted the most perfect wish that there could ever be, and finally, this special wish has just occurred to me. So now I'll close my eyes and hope my heartfelt wish comes true. I wish you peace and happiness and love the whole year through. The end. What a sweet book. Reindeer Christmas by Mark Kimball Moulton, illustrated by Karen Pillard Good. I hope you all have a happy holiday season and a Merry Christmas and a very happy year.